Well, guys, we're still in South Carolina. We have uh, a special treat today. We're uh, going to go meet up with another YouTuber, uh, Myrtle Beach Motorsports Salvage. And uh, we're going to check out a shop here at the airport, and then we'll head out to the yard and uh, see what we can find. So we'll see you real soon. That's pretty cool. I believe the truck was the same paint, but it's just uh, older, a little bit older. So what year? What year is the Fiero chassis? It is either a '86 or '87. I can't remember. Oh, that's cool. We painted our paint job. Mm -hmm. So those, so the helicopters are leaving every few minutes then? Yeah, every few minutes we have uh, tours that are two minutes up to 30 minutes. They go all the way to North Carolina line. Oh wow, that's awesome. It's $180. Wow. Ride and, uh, they have a blast. You see all kinds of wildlife out there, sharks and oh, sea that's turtles cool. and dolphins. And <laughs> um, these kits uh, in the 80s, they actually, you had to cut the frame and extend it six inches for the wheelbase. Yep. Wow, that's cool. I did some of the finished work. I used to work at a Pontiac dealer. Oh, cool. And I got a small collection of Pontiacs at home. Oh, nice. All right, so we are headed over to the hangar. And uh, Martin here is going to give us quick little tour before we head over to the shop. So this should be quite the adventure. We didn't uh, we didn't really plan this, so uh, it's gonna be fun. Wow. wow. You would be amazed at how old these planes are. Uh, the average age on these planes is from the mid 60s no kidding the helicopters are newer we got them pretty modern they have to be kept up the new standards look at this stuff wow looks pretty cool Engines are pretty much uh, like Volkswagen engines. 1940s technology. Wow. Air cooled. Has the modern upgrades. The blue seals that is a very new uh, upgrade just for uh, seal cooling. It's amazing. Don't film this guy. He's a little. Uh, <laughs> Go. Look at this guy. And this is a 2010? Yeah. He's got a few different models. That's what he's got right now. Yeah, that's pretty nice. motion simulator it's worth more than one of the really small Cessnas. You can actually get a uh, flat credit by flying on the ground with it. Oh really? Lots of parts. Oh wow. This one has software that you can fly out of every any airport in the world. And so you're flying in the surround TV screens, you're yeah. actually seeing the uh, the airport and the surroundings. And uh, you're, you're uh, 
If you're a instructor, he can change the weather. Like if you're getting pretty good at flying, he can say, hey, we're going to throw you a curveball. Here's a hail storm. What's he going to do? <laughs> oh, wow. It's full motion in every direction. That is really cool. Very awesome machine. We went to Nashville, picked it up, had to take it apart, put it in the trailer and reassemble it. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, like it's got the hydraulics to move it up. Oh, yeah, the hydraulics moves everywhere. Oh, that's awesome. Big video game. That's as close as you can get to the real deal. <laughs> and the controls are here. We can swap it out and you can fly different aircraft. So you're actually you're using the actual real controls oh, and wow. different dashboards. That is really neat. Wow. That's good stuff. Cool little lounge right here. Oh, yeah. This is for. <laughs> oh, nice. Look at that. That's great. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is great. This building up here is the biggest paint shop in the East Coast. Boeing probably has a the bigger one. Oh, okay. A small airline in here. Then we got a small car boot. Ford car. <laughs> You're right. So this plane here was, a, what was it again? B-Till Bonanza. Oh, wow. Nicknamed the Dr. Killer. Wow. Look at that. It's getting all new avionics installed. Look at that. They don't make them like this anymore. <laughs> wow. Wow, look at the back wings. That's something else. Stabilators. Stabilators. Oh, very cool. The, there's a pretty awesome maintenance schedule on these Robinsons. Everything has a time on it where you have to change it within so many hours. Okay. Um, so basically after 2,200 hours and 12 years, we have to strip it down to just the fiberglass shell. And half of it gets replaced, the other half gets overhauled. Oh, wow. And all inspected. Uh, new blades, engine overhaul, new cylinders. Um, every two overhauls, you have to change the tail boom. It's a lot of maintenance involved, so it's not something that you, a rich guy, just want to sit on. You want to use it and work it. Yeah. To get your get your value out of it. I can't believe how big this area is and how. I mean, uh, it's nice and cool in here. It's 80 degrees outside, and this is. Uh, it's a trick that people don't realize. But we, the doors close in the summertime because yeah. this concrete will keep the temperature down. Maybe oh, we'll crack it just a little bit, and it makes a little wind tunnel. Yeah. And it really keeps it cool. Awesome.